Hello guys, it's your girl Sisi back at it again. So um, if you're new here, karibu sana kama when yule yule and the kwa yule yule. So as you guys have seen from the past videos, I'm in Ushago, Ushago Dala, Kisumu Dala. You know the thing? Really? Yeah, I'm in Kisumu Dala and you know the vibes here, you know. So um, today I want to take you out with me because uh, actually I came here to look for content, you know. Yeah, so today we are supposed to head out to Kitmikai. I know you guys, if you can remember your social studies really well, you know where Kitmikai is. Don't worry, I'm vlogging with my phone, but I'll catch you later with some good, good quality. Yeah, so I'm just, we are going to go to Kitmikai and then later on we are going to head to Dere Island. Yeah, and uh, we are going to call it a vlog and I hope you guys are going to enjoy this vlog because man, I'm doing it for you. You know the vibe? Come on, just subscribe. Hit that subscribe button, my G. <laughs> Hit that subscribe button. And guys, I'm so excited to be here. Man, they have, have been chilling. I've just been unajatui the vibe here. Away from Nairobi, away from masks, away from all that. Boo. Uh, yeah, so I just want to go show you something before we leave for Kitmikai. My dad has been doing some nice, nice jobs and I, I feel like I should appreciate what he has been doing because he watches me and dad, if you're watching me, I'm proud of you, my man. <laughs> I'm proud of you. So yeah, let, let, me go, let me go show you guys the, the farm and what he's been doing. And yeah, we're going to call it a vlog and at the end of the day, all glory and honor shall be given unto the most high job. So... I'll catch you later, my guys. Dala has a nice son. <laughs> so guys, um, that's all I can show you for now. So I'm gonna catch you in Kitmikai as I show you our beautiful land of Semekobita situated in Kisumu County. You know? <laughs> yeah, so guys, I hope you, you've enjoyed until where we are right now. So if you haven't still subscribed, kindly subscribe because it really supports this channel and it really shows the growth on this channel i'm actually be doing this on a mango 
it's not working it really supports <laughs> anyway yeah so guys uh, i'm going to catch you in kitsmikai and dere island those places are so beautiful and i know you guys have only seen them in um, your social studies books am your high school actually it was high school was it high school or or nini was it high school or university what is it called was it high school or primary school i can't really remember so manze i'll catch you there okay so don't get it don't go anywhere call your friends to come and see this video because i'm, I'm also very sure you guys didn't visit this place with your school so yeah i'm going to show you for free free of charge all you need is your bundles and your phone and your eyes so guys to partner kit mikai as we enjoy the view traditional house of law, culture, documents. When we don't have the kosher meal, yeah. we are using this one yeah. to grind. for grinding yeah. the sorghum and millet, yeah. for making the flour, yeah. for cooking it. Yeah. Yeah. the millets here, yeah. then we grind until we get the soft flour uh -huh. for cooking the flour. Yeah. This one we call it duo yeah. or yeah. alijabo. Yeah. The corn corn. Uh -huh. Dark means hot. Uh -huh. Corn means to grab. Uh -huh. The hot for cooking the uh -huh. When we don't have the uh, cups, we are using this one for drinking the water with the porridge. Uh -huh. We call it a water. Uh -huh. We can go near the, the rock and uh -huh. get another story. <laughs> People come here to pray, I do fasting. They just started praying here. Up on a it work and the a place of my soul. So the rocket is written to Kikai, but it is written in Luo. But I want to tell you the reason why it is written to Kikai the meaning and what should be done here by our traditional people. So the word kit means rock. Mikai means first wife. So the first wife of, of Luo is called Mikai. Put in the rock of the first wife. So according to Luo, polygamy it's like to get more wife. So the first wife is called uh, Mikai. The second wife is called Nakira. The third wife is called Reru. If you add more, we will call it Jadoho. So it is the rock of the first one. That is the meaning of Kitmika. So by long time, we have our grand-grandfather who came here when the era was Jewish. 
that man was calling patient. That man was come and look at this where he can stay. But he found this place better. Then he walked to go inside. Inside, we have the caves. After showing inside, he was started to come back and relax here. After relaxing, he decided to put the symbol of, of the house down there, which is foundation. That means the land is belong to the And then he was decided to go out to go and build a big home from Afsa. So that big home, Mrs. Harding is quite from their home. When he wake up in the morning, he'll take a traditional stool and come and rest here every morning. So if someone wants to get in their home, but they cannot find the grave. What I tell, Geso was going to that rock, but he loved that rock like the first one. So there is a day, that sequence of Geso, I decided to come and see where the man can have and discuss it with Geso. Which name did he like to give this rock? He can give it Mikai. Mikai is the first lady that is coming here before there is no any lady come on this place. It's why the name comes. Out. But it can help the people from this area in many ways, not only the name. During the drought, this also can show the sign of water coming from the top and down. And those from this line, that symbol means the rocket is dry. When he gets through that symbol, something disturbs the liver and walk away to look why there is dry. And it's walk to each doctor. And this doctor tells him, so, go back and pray to your stone. Your stone is blocking the rain. You must go and doing the sacrifice near the stone. Then you get rain. Why did they come back and put the meeting here? How to come here for sacrifice? It will be sacrificed with a he goat, white one in color, no separate color, and two chicken. Yes, we bring the sacrifice here, we kill the goat near here, then we put fire here, and the rest will be sitting on those ones. If you want to kill the chicken, you cannot use it. You touch the leg of the hand and feed them, the of the hand on the stone. Then put on the fire, all the feathers will be burning and the rest protect it well and again we remove the intestine of the hen and the blood of the goat and the carry to pray here to God. After praying, they just slaughter, slaughter the meat, roasted the meat and eaten without the blood. But on the second day, the rain will fall until tomorrow in the morning and each and every one going to the house. So once the old man sit and the rain on the stone, the kindness will be topped and the rain is going on. And all the trees which surround here, those are the medicine, those are the apples, nature, trees. So you can see the candles. We have religious group that are come here for pastor. Like the church, which is called Maria, is using the candle for their prayer. So that one is this tree. Want to feel myself not crazy? Can't take it. I wish I'd get away from here. Never back to this. It's all that I want to, and I'm so scared about you. Cause my UK is not that cool.
call it ka mama mama maria Baby 